Hey, what is up guys? Jeremy here and welcome back to another video. So I'm going to be showing you guys how to downgrade iOS 10.3.3 back to 10.3.2. You can also downgrade from any of the iOS 11 betas uh, using this method as well. So if you want to downgrade back to 10.3.2 from that, this method will work as well. Now I wanted to make this tutorial for you guys just because rumor has it that there might be a possible 10.3.1 and a 10.3.2 jailbreak coming in about a month or two so fingers crossed that that jailbreak does come uh, anybody that does want a jailbreak uh, like I said in my previous video I would recommend to downgrade your device uh, right now before Apple stops signing 10.3.2 because as soon as they stop signing the firmware you will no longer be able to downgrade and if a jailbreak does come out that means you will not be able to jailbreak so we're gonna go ahead and jump into settings here and I will show you guys uh, that my device is on 10.3.3 so there you go as you can see 10.3.3 now the next thing you're gonna want to do is go ahead and back out and go into your iCloud and what you're gonna need to do uh, in order to restore your device you will have to turn off find my iPhone so be sure to turn that off uh, and then go ahead and plug your device uh, into your computer mine is already plugged in and we're gonna go ahead and jump over to my computer Alrighty, now once you guys are on your computer, the very first thing you're going to want to do is go into Safari or whatever web browser you use. Uh, go to this website here. I'll leave the link for this down in the description. Uh, so come to this website and then basically you're going to go through each step to choose the firmware uh, that you need to download because we will have to manually download the firmware to downgrade to it. So I'm going to go ahead and select on iPhone and I am downgrading the iPhone 6. Uh, like I said, be sure to choose your correct device. Um, but as you guys can see at the top here, this website will actually show you uh, which firmwares Apple is still signing. So before you even attempt to download the firmware, just make sure it's still being signed. If you guys are watching this in the future, uh, Apple might not be signing 10.3.2 anymore, so you might not be able to downgrade. So like I said, be sure to check out this website. Uh, now, once you have come here and you're ready to go, all you got to do is click on the firmware you want to download uh, and then just click on the big blue download button as you guys can see right there. Now, it will take uh, some time for this to download. It is a big file. It is the complete operating system. Uh, so give it some time. And then once it is done uh, downloading, you can go ahead and throw it on your desktop. Mine is on my desktop. And we'll go into iTunes. Now, again, like I said, make sure your device is plugged in so it's detected. As you guys can see, it's recognizing my iPhone 6. It's on iOS 10.3.3. Uh, so from here, what we're going to do is we're going to, on a Mac, hold the Command button. And on Windows, I believe it's hold the Shift button. So just hold the proper button and click on Restore iPhone. And you'll know it worked correctly because it'll give you the option to choose the firmware you want to restore to. So as you guys can see, I have 10.3.2 on my desktop. So I'm going to go ahead and select it and click on Open. And then you will get a pop-up here saying iTunes will erase and restore your iPhone, blah, blah, blah. Just click on restore. And uh, the process will begin for downgrading. And I'll be back once it's all done. Alrighty guys, my device is done restoring and we'll go ahead and jump into settings and I'll just show you guys really quickly that it is 10.3.2 going to about so there you go guys as you can see we are back down to 10.3.2 from 10.3.3 so hopefully a jailbreak will be coming out for this version of iOS if it does that would be seriously awesome uh, but anyways I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this tutorial or it helped you out if it did definitely throw me a thumbs up that helps me out a lot here at the channel and if you guys want to see more videos like this in the future don't forget to click that subscribe button this has been jeremy and i'll catch you guys in the next one later